Good day viewers, you are welcome. Here we have an interesting functional equations where only 10% pass this. Given that f of x minus 1 equals x squared minus x plus 1, I want to find f of x. So I will be solving this in two different ways. And let's see the first method of solving this. The domain of this function allows any real number. So we have f of x minus 1 equals x squared minus x plus 1. Let's form manipulate this. This side is a quadratic as we have the power of 2 at this variable. So which make it a quadratic. And can we factorize this? That is the first question. So, this is not factorizable as I'm going to manipulate this because I want to have something of this nature which is x minus 1 at this side. So, if I have this equals, suppose I have this as x squared minus x. So, if I say 2 minus 1, that is uh, 1. And if I say minus 1 plus 2, and that is still 1. And if I say minus 2 minus 1 so that gives us minus 1 and for this one we have it as minus 1 so what i will do here is so we say plus x and minus 2x and since we have plus 1 here i can just call this one minus 2 then plus 3 minus 2 plus 3 this gives us 1 and after having this, we proceed by grouping this together. Suppose I group this, we are going to factor out x. So taking out x, we have this as x plus 1. And grouping this only by taking out minus 2, in the bracket we have x plus 1 as well. So I'm going to put the all of this in a bracket, then plus 3 outside the bracket. Next, here is x and here is minus 2. Let's take that one together as x minus 2. And also we have x plus 1. This in bracket. And uh, we have plus 3 here. Everything is equivalent to f of x minus 1. Then, since this is what we have, here we need x minus 1. And I want to make this as x minus 1 as well. Here we have x plus 1. What I will do is, I will be changing everything here to x minus 1, then minus 1. Also, this is x minus 1, and we have plus 2 to get s minus 1. So this equals x minus 1 minus 1, bracket, x minus 1 plus 2, then plus 3. Everything is equals f of x minus 1. Then we have to change x minus 1 to x since we need to find f of x. So changing that, we have f of x equals, this is x minus 1, we change it to x minus 1 only. Then also this is x minus 1, we change it to x plus 2, and here is plus 3. By expanding this one, we have x times x, that is x squared, plus x times 2, that is 2x, minus 1 times x, we have it as minus x, minus 1 times plus 2, we have it as plus 2, then plus 3 outside the bracket. So after having this, we have x squared plus 2x minus x, that gives us plus x, then 2 plus 3, that is 5. This shows that our f of x here is given as x squared plus x plus 5. This is the first way of solving these functional equations. Let's see how we can solve this in another way and see which one is much more easier to follow. For the second method, suppose I let x minus 1 equals u. So this is substitution method. By making x a subject, we add 1 to both sides. And here cancelled, 
as we have x equals u plus 1 or 1 plus u. So you come back to the given question and replace every single thing with what we have this at the substitution. Therefore, we have f of, instead of x minus 1, we write it as u equals, and also we have x squared, which becomes u plus 1 squared minus, open bracket, x is u plus 1, then plus 1. We try to expand u plus 1 squared. u plus 1 squared is u plus 1 multiplied by u plus 1. Then we multiply this also as minus u minus 1 then plus 1. As this is what we got, then let's multiply this together. By multiplying this, what we are going to have is u times u, that is u squared plus u times 1. We have it as u plus 1 times u, that is u plus 1 times 1, that is 1. Then we have this as minus u and uh, so here becomes this cancelled and we have only minus u therefore we have f of u equals we have minus u plus u cancelled then this is u squared plus u plus one so this is what we have for f of u then we have to change u to x as we have f of x equals x squared plus x plus 1. So this is how I solve this in two different ways. And uh, that is all.